So the machine starts with the siphon, which causes the pressure difference, and so that's why the water flows from the high head to the low head. So the water that's flowing through the siphon then hits the sponge, and through capillary action, it absorbs up the sponge until the weight is big enough that it falls. And after it falls, it releases the tape over the um, exit right here. And so from continuity with the higher velocity and lower velocity, it causes the um, water to spew out and hit the first finger block. And then conservation of momentum, the rest of the finger blocks fall along with it. And with the conservation of momentum that hits the Jenga, it hits the can. The can rolls down the ramp and goes into the Tupperware, which causes a bigger weight that goes against the buoyant force that pulls onto the string and then the sugar falls into the coffee cup. Now wait. <laughs>